Davis, Crouch, Miller, Worth, Rourke, Hoover, Walker, Bielham. Looking for Green, out of four. It's waving, we're racing. Side by side in turns number one and two. Jones is gonna protect the inside. Again, Reimer around the outside as here comes McDermott, three wide into three. McDermott, low line, Jones right in the middle. Taylor Reimer up on the high side. It's gonna be the Mount Stout car number 40. Chase McDermott out to the early advantage. Here comes Kyle Jones around the outside as well as the 25K. Taylor Reimer, Reimer. Garden, the runner-up position, a little bit cross-threaded. That's going to bottleneck everybody on the exit of four. No harm, no foul, as Reimer going to lose a lot of ground on the exit of turn number four. So it's going to be car number 40, Chase McDermott, the 17, Kyle Jones, the five, Gavin Bochel now up to round out the podium. Round, and we have a battle inside the 17. Kyle Jones, he's going to go to the inside out maneuver now as McDermott going to pull it to the low line. Side by side at the flag stand. Yellow flag in the air. The 31B of Kyle Bileman. Top 10, looking for the green. Out of four. Back under green here at Valley. Jones going to look to the high line as McDermott holding steady on that inside. It's McDermott with the lead as we go into turns number three and four. Reimer as here comes Brenham Crouch. Gavin Bochel up on the high side. 56 of Mitchell Davis going to let it thread out through the high side as well. Laps starting to tick away. Ten laps in the books this time by Jones. As we have them battle for second and third. The 17U Kyle Jones. Here comes Mitchell Davis. Mitchell Davis up to the runner-up position. Davis a feature win with the Wingless Auto Racing Sprint League back at Jacksonville Speedway in 2020. Trying to find his first career feature win here with the Lucas Oil Power Ride National and West Midget Leagues. It's gonna be a long distance between him and our race leader, the 40 of Chase McDermott. Up to the high side, no, the 56 of Mitchell Davis as the 21 of Carter Sharp gonna look low on the five of both shell. Three wide down the front straightaway. Has the Shark found something on that low line as Bochel gonna throw a slider on the 56 of Davis. Davis gonna cross him back over. Down the back straightaway, side by side. Second and third, fourth place. Thought about making it three wide, not quite there. Taylor Reimer, Jace Park, Joe B. Miller, Joey Worth, Kyle Bauman. Rounding out the top 10, everybody still chasing McDermott. It's Chase McDermott on the low side. Mitchell Davis up high line. Carter Sarr, Gavin Bochel. Four cars all within striking distance as Davis gonna get a good run down the back straightaway, pulling wheel to wheel. Entering turns number three and four. A little bit of a bobble right in the middle by the 56 of Mitchell Davis. Side by side at the flag stand. Low line, not going away. Top side, coming into perfection. Out of turn two, new leader. It's gonna be the 56, Mitchell Davis. The five, Gavin Bochel. A little bit of curb clanging through three. No harm, no foul. 56 of Davis, the five of Bochel. 21, Carter Sark holding steady on the inside line as the 40 of Jace McDermott is still in the hunt, sitting third. Fourth. Taylor Reimer back to fifth as the white flag comes in. One more time around. Mitchell Davis up on the high side. Chase McDermott following in his tire tracks down the back straightaway. Entering into turns number three and four as caution flag. Caution comes out on. Out of four. White flag waves one more time around. Mitchell Davis up on the high side. Chase McDermott going to try to slide him through turns number one and two. McDermott has the lead down the back straightaway. A slide job to perfection. Can Davis get it back through turns number three and four? A little bit of a tire tap as is McDermott at the line. Chase McDermott at the line by less than a quarter of a car length over the five of Gavin Bochel. Right there rounding out the podium.